What's up guys, I've Bob Maniac here, and for today's review, I'm going to be reviewing two apps actually, but one, well, no, I'm going to be reviewing one, but I'm going to be showing you two, just so I can compare one to the other. So the one I'm going to be reviewing is called Eden, and the one I'm going to be comparing it to is called Minecraft World Explorer. So let's go into Eden. In Eden, what you do is make your own Minecraft worlds. I don't think you can transport these actually to to um, the Minecraft game on like your PC but you just get to make them and uh, yeah that's it May have fun with it so you can download and upload different ones the ones that you can download ones some with other, other people made and you can upload ones that you made uh, you can delete them add them and right now I have two I have this one iPod Maniac which is a fan made one actually and then I have World 3 which is just one I made which I'm going to show you first and then for the ending of the video I'll come back and show you the iPod Maniac the fan made one so right here as you can see what you do, you're basically in Minecraft, you can um, you can go around, you can use the pickaxe, if you click that and then click on the material, you will break it. If you hit the plus, you can build whatever material, say I want to build bricks. So once you hit the plus, this is set to build bricks, so wherever you click, it will build bricks. You also have the ability to set things on fire, which is something that is not in Minecraft World, Ex uh, World Explorer, which I really like, the fact that it's in here. And look at that, uh, it will burn it, it starts the whole tree on fire, I think it's going to stretch onto this tree. Now I feel bad, now I feel like a f I started a forest fire. Oh well, shit happens. <laughs> so yeah, look at that, that's, that, you can't do that in Minecraft World Explorer, as you'll see in a little bit. And that's, that's random. Okay. And uh, you can jump. I'm not, I don't know, my thumbs like feels sticky on the screen, so I'm not using that right now. You can jump with this jump button. I'm pretty sure you can do that on Minecraft. Yeah, you can do that in the World Explorer. And you move with the joystick and you aim. This is very smooth. The graphics, obviously, they are shit, but that is because it is a Minecraft-based game, and Minecraft graphics are terrible. So in here, I just built a quick little house made out of, uh, this looks like glass. I'm not quite sure exactly what it is, but we're going to pretend it's glass. And, just to have some kicks, you can build dynamite, and what you can do in this game, you can build dynamite in the World Explorer, but you, what you can't do in World Explorer that you can do with this, you can set the dynamite on fire, and you can blow up this whole place. So that's what I'm going to show you. You ready? We're going to blow this place to bits. First, actually, let me uh, show you just what it looks like up there. You see that? Here, I'll cut this down, and I'll rebuild this one. There you go. I just made sure every square block has something right next to it. We're just going to blow this place to hell, and we're going to have fun watching it. So, let's put one more piece of dynamite. Right there. Alright. Now, let's get this baby started. Let's light it on fire. You ready? We're going to get an aerial view, too. I'm going to go right here, then I'm going to build a bunch of uh, grass. So, quick. Grass. Ah. Uh, ah. Uh, grass. Grass. There you go. Holy shit, I fell. <laughs> Oh my god. See, I, the weird thing about dynamite, it blows up before it disappears. I don't really understand that, but hey, that's just how it was designed. Holy, oh my god. Oh my god, we made a crater. I wonder how far you can go down. Should we explore? Yes, let's do it. Let's explore. You guys are going on an adventure with, oh, there it is. <laughs> that was a quick adventure. Sorry about this, now we're going to have to go all the way back up. Do, 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 do. Do, 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 do. I'm just putting a huge patch of grass where there used to be like cement. Nice. Okay, so yeah, as you can see, that just totally demolished it. And that's one fun thing I love to do in this Minecraft, the Eden. Just blow shit up. Look at that. It made a huge crater. It just looks epic. And that's basically the only thing I enjoy doing in this. Huh. Well, might as well burn those two. You know what I mean? And wait, there it go. Oh, yes. Explosions. Okay, so this game is really, it's not that fun. It's just nice to uh, explore if you're into Minecraft. And now I'm going to show you the difference between this and Minecraft World Explorer.
just going to do quick. This isn't going to be long. Just wanted to show you right away what's different. Okay, robot and pencil is awesome. We make things. Do you now? <laughs> hmm. So there, you can make different worlds. It's got, I like their menu better, but their actual game is worse. Or not a game, I'd say their actual, I don't know what you want to call this. Uh, <laughs> let's see, loading, yeah, the loading on this one is much longer. Very annoying. Come on. Make some music. Okay, so as you can see, you can choose the material. I choose TNT if I want, okay. Here's the jump button, it's a little spring. This one's a lot less smooth, as you can see, it's like lagging up. Um, when you build something, there you go, I can't start that on fire, but I can take it down. And right here, cycles between build, which is the hammer, and bomb, which is the, the destroy. And that's pretty much it, this one's, I don't like this one at all. Boom. And also in both of these, you don't have any falling damage. So that's it, this one's terrible, definitely get the other one. And I want to show you a quick finale as I go. Uh, just what the, the uh, fan made, the level that he made for me. And um, for this app, I recommend, I don't, let's see, if you're into Minecraft and you actually want to do stuff like this and build worlds, and hold on, this is what he made me, iPod Maniac. That is awesome. Thanks, uh, Colton Runner, you're awesome. <laughs> and this is me displaying your world. If anybody else wants to send stuff, like not eat this, because I already did the review, but any other things you think I could add into my reviews, then go for it. I'll most likely add it in, unless it's like some porn or something. I'm definitely not going to put that in and get like uh, banned. So there you go, iPod Maniac. And it's alternating colors. Alright, anyways, this app gets a... If you're actually looking for looking for this and you want this, I would give it a, like if you're looking for Minecraft on the iPod, I'd give it a 3 out of 5 because you can't actually play, there's no creatures, and um, you don't actually get to mine the, the uh, stuff that you build with, which kind of defeats the whole purpose of Minecraft if you can just have everything at your disposal at any given time. So that just defeats the purpose. And if you're looking for an app, like you're like me, you don't... You're not looking specifically for a Minecraft app, you're just looking for a fun app. This is like a 2, maybe even a 1.5. I'm going to give it a 2 though, be lenient because I'm nice. And uh, yeah, definitely don't think you should get this if you're not into Minecraft at all. That's just stupid. But if you are into it and you just feel like you, every once in a while you want to make a random world, then go for it. Get this, try it out. Um, I think it's a dollar in the App Store. Probably should check. If it's not, I'll put it up here. I need to start checking before the reviews. I, I was getting good at that, and then I forgot this one. But yeah, so that's my review. Hope you guys enjoyed it, and I will see you later.